you gonna come here where he is? Back at the Villanova. Wow, I just dropped my keys in such a bad spot. That's so terrible. I'm back at the Villanova dorms, and um, it's nice, kind of relaxing. I was home for Father's Day. My camera's gonna die. The Baldwin School. The nicest, this is gonna be really zoomed on my face, the nicest architecture I've seen since I've been here. It's actually ridiculous. It's a private, all girls high school. It's crazy. I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm not gonna film too much here, just gonna show you guys the building and leave because this is a school and I don't wanna invade anybody's privacy. So we'll make this quick. Beautiful, like, <laughs> I'm speechless. It's a castle. It's I don't know if they stay in maybe their rooms up here because it looks like those could be bedrooms and uh, maybe they stay here overnight. I'm not really sure what the deal is, but it is quite possibly the most beautiful school I've ever seen in my entire life. And it's not even a college. That's one of the many pieces of amazing architecture that I hope I can show you while I'm here. Um, I want to explore myself, so I'm just going to bring my camera along and we're going to go on some fun journeys. Uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's keep going. Sweet green. I got to eat first. Oh, fuck, it's so bright. Can't see shit. So I came back from work, I was extremely tired, and um, I woke up an hour and a half later, and it always scares me when I kind of run out of time towards the end of the day, because I'm, I'm the type of person who just really wants to get like everything accomplished and all that, and it's a really bad uh, mentality. I woke up and I'm like, okay, like the quickest thing I can do, the quickest way I can get food in my system is just to eat fast food, and every time I eat fast food, I regret it after, so I'm like, okay, I'm not going to do that. Um, I ran to the overpriced, or drove to the overpriced sweet green to uh, get some food. Reflection from that, it seems to reflect from something so simple like that, but just the food you eat literally is your fuel, and if you want to run well, you know, eat good food. But don't pay for overpriced food either. So find a balance, <laughs> for sure. Um, but this is my first time in this area too, and it's just absolutely beautiful, so uh, I'm happy I get to explore this with you guys, and I'll try to show off um, as much of these little intricate parts as I can. thing YouTube is missing. I think Google tried to do this once. Just kidding. The smell here is absolutely great and every time I come to Pennsylvania it is just the best smelling place ever in the world. It makes you miss it the second you leave. It's nothing better and almost every single place here looks like a castle. Okay, I 
I found a dog. I can go home now. That's it. That's a wrap. See you guys later. It's been real. <laughs> that was the only reason I left my home. This house has a motherfucking bridge attached to it. Like, what the hell? That is beautiful. That's cool. That's a cool house right there. You won't see that every day. That's what I don't get. There's no, there's not a lot of consistency here. It's like, it almost feels, every house is a little different, actually very different, but yet each house fits into the environment it sits in so beautifully and so well. That's what confuses me. There's no pattern. It's just, yeah, there's some stone here and there, but overall, it's just a bunch of beautiful houses, all very different, but they all place themselves so nicely in their location and the environment that they are. Looks like someone wasn't feeling too nice. People stealing all the balls. That's always how it is. Ooh, a lot of dogs. <gasps> Puppies. Hey. You are. You care if I take a picture of it? Is that okay? okay. Yeah. You are a huge dog. Oh, I'm gonna fall. <laughs> Jeez. That's amazing. He's beautiful. Hey. What are you doing? You're gonna get lost. I'm trying to find my way out, but I don't want to leave yet, so... I don't really know what I'm going to do. I want to see more dogs. I came here for the dogs, man, and I can't find any more dogs. Just that big one. Lucy! Hi, Lucy. You're the smallest dog here yet. <laughs> You're going to have some competition. All right, bye, Lucy.